Alright, what's going on guys? It's Allman. Welcome back to another Call of Duty Modern Warfare video. So a lot of you guys have been asking how I reached rank 155 so quickly and just how I've been grinding, like what's my best tips, what's my best like things that I've done, like there's certain game modes I play or any of that, like what's, what is my secret? So I'll tell you guys everything about that in this video, but from what I know from my statistics, 84% of you guys aren't subscribed, so make sure you do like this type, if you guys do like this type of content, make sure you do leave a like on it and subscribe and help me grow. We've gained a lot of subscribers from the past few videos and how, how I've been grinding and how just how quickly I reached it with, with it's only been like three seasons or not three days I mean so like how I reached with Ring 55 everyone just questioning questioning it but um, I'll give you guys my best tips and tricks but make sure you guys do subscribe it helps me a lot as a content creator and helps me grow and just so I can start you know improving my channel as best I possibly can but yeah, let's get into it so uh, we'll start off with like the best rank or like the best way or like or no actually we'll start off from the like the lowest tier to the highest tier depending on how you view it and I'll do an honorable mention so we'll start off with the honorable mention is that trials if you guys I only have three trial tokens because I usually do a lot of trial tokens and there's only a certain thing I do obviously I can do all these season ones and stuff like that and there is a glitch that in season five one but honestly I didn't do that you guys can see um I haven't done any of these I haven't attempted any of these that's because I don't like doing that glitch it's, it's a big exploit you guys can do that if you guys want want if you guys want just it wasn't for me and I like doing the specific one it's called uh the marksman challenge from season zero the reason I like doing this is because it helps me with my aim and it just it's just something I enjoy it just helps me get practice so all you gotta do is i'm not gonna do the challenge because i don't want to waste an attempt i kind of want to save that for next season but you basically just gotta shoot targets down and from certain ranges with a 0.25 uh 0.75 Seven point three five seven, my bad. Point three five seven scope pistol, um, pretty fun. I like it. You guys just mount, shoot targets for like a few seconds. Um, but my highest score is three thousand two hundred twenty-seven, and you guys get XP based on range. So if I click on it, you guys can see your rewards. You guys, you guys get two thousand five hundred, five thousand XP, two thousand seven hundred fifty, seven thousand five hundred XP, and three thousand for ten k XP. So that's a really good way way especially with double xp and um if you guys have your uh regiment you guys get quadruple xp and you guys will get so much xp just for doing one so but things i didn't really use this um i saved my tokens basically when there's double xp so i basically just spammed it when there's double xp so i didn't have to waste any double xp tokens myself because um i'd expect like a double xp event coming out soon so it really surprised me and caught me off guard so i just used it when that time was coming over and i try to do it during my regiment time so like around 350 or not 350 650 is when i have my schedule um double xp for my regiment so i just used it during that time try to get as much xp as i can so that's my honorable mention trials tokens are actually really good um enough from let's like work our way up so the next one is probably just playing tdm hardcore so what i would recommend is just depending on your play style i usually like playing hardcore domination it's like one of my favorite game modes you guys get so much score um my kill streaks i run you guys can see right here i run uav um i used to run vtol but at the time at this time i'm recording this i've been having glitches with the vtol so that's why i have it off and i've been having support elo but what i would recommend is maybe like uavs personal radars and um like a VTOL or something because what UAVs do they give me more assists so I can get more XP it just helps with the team a lot or even if you guys want take off the heli take off the support kilo but on a you know end of end UAV helps out your team a lot and more XP just helps out so that's what I would recommend but uh, towards your streaks but um hardcore dom is one of my favorites and usually if there's hardcore like shoot the ship or anything like that or anything like that but I 100% usually play domination maybe i'll add like kill confirmed or anything like that but i've been trying to play weak fair because the new maps are, or like the maps are in there and they're actually really decent i've been trying to get shipment lobbies in there and just finish out challenges so that's just my personal recommendation but if you guys want to be partying up with like whole team because you guys get an extra 10 percent boost because if you look at the bottom of the bottom middle of my screen it says xp tokens available and above that it says battle pass on 10 percent xp bonus so you guys get xp depending on how many people are in their party if they have the battle pass so if you guys get a whole squad you guys are just grinding out um for sure you can be getting 10 percent more xp depending on how many people are in there and that's like a best way for me grinding when it comes to that and you guys obviously have to be dropping kills um there's no specific class i run or anything but what i would honestly recommend like um obviously i'm working on these guns right here but like let's go to my mp5 for example um go to the gunsmith for a perk there's a perk called more money so i would 100 percent recommend that if you're really good at aiming at headshots and stuff like that you guys get more xp especially with the squatting up with your teammates and stuff like that you guys will be grinding a lot of xp and you guys could have your regiment X XP at the same time. So like if we go to my social and we go to regiments, you guys see I have a lot of people in here. Some people I know, some people I don't know, um, some family members, stuff like that. And if you guys want to be in this regiment, just let me know. Comment below and I'll, guys, I'll add you guys. But um, yeah, so I just usually have a regiment XP. If you guys look above my name right now, it says every hour of double XP 
or I get it every um, day, an hour of a double XP at 6.50 p.m. So mine, obviously mine is passed already because um, I'm recording this at 1 a.m. But um, yeah, I just have active at that time. You guys have regiments, just get into those. You guys can always leave regiment and join back another one. And then you guys can just always exploit that in a way. But um, I wouldn't really do that, but that's up to you guys. But that's my um, other um, tip. But we'll, we'll save the best for last and I'll show you guys why. So that's like another way. Um, another way that I've been doing stuff is I go to my barracks um, and I go to, or not barracks, I go to my challenges and my missions. So if you guys all go to my intels, um, you guys can do all these. It's like another honorable mention type of thing. Um, you guys can do all these missions. It's all you guys gotta do is find missing stuff in Warzone. Now there's plenty of videos about like a prestigious key is like a really good recommendation of mine. Uh, go to his video, he has all these um, those called objectives, locations, all that you guys can do is you guys get so much XP, especially with double XP. And like, if you guys are doing this when you guys have um, regiment XP, quadruple XP, you guys can get so much XP for just doing these little missions like 10k XP for like doing nothing, all these 10k XPs. You guys can just stack up all these, you guys get so much XP. So that's what I would recommend. And there's even the weekly challenges that you guys can do. Um, like, I have some of these done and I wasn't even trying to go for them. Like, there's still the Warzone ones I haven't even finished. So I usually try to go through these, but. Um, that's another way of getting XP, and there's those daily challenges you guys can do, and then uh, and the, all these missions that you guys can do. They added new ones, so they added new missions this season, so like for rewards and co-op and everything. So once I'm done with those, I'll do videos on those definitely. But um, that's like another way you guys can XP. And then honestly, my uh, final or like the best way honestly of getting XP is co-op. And you guys be, might be wondering why the hell co-op. Um, but before I talk about co-op, I literally just remember one more thing. Warzone and the, the thing is you guys can definitely do Warzone. It's, it's like a comparison like co-op and Warzone are like a really close tight um, Near each other like what's the best way XP, but overall I think co-op has to be the best but Warzone I would recommend go to plunder. So like let's go to Warzone real quick I gotta turn on my crossplay for this, but um Warzone do plunder plunder or BR that just, just really depends on how you guys do plunder just do a bunch of contracts those contracts give you so much XP I've gone up to 30k XP 40k XP 58k XP just really random up to 100k XP just by playing plunder and I just do all I gotta do is get contracts you guys can do the same thing in BR get kills and everything like that or mini royale um that's just up to you guys what you guys are personal preferences but Warzone really does give a lot of xp it's just that it depends on how you play your play style and everything like that so i would really definitely uh definitely recommend that but the best way to for me personally has to be co-op and if um if i have any screenshots or anything like that from my past like uploads or like my past gameplay if i have any like 200k xp showcases like that i'll definitely pull it up on the screen right now i'll try to look for them if i can but um yeah, I've gone up to 200k XP in a match of co-op, and this isn't me exploiting. This isn't me boosting because I feel like um I got called I got called boosting or whatever, but um I don't boost. Boosting is not something that you guys should do. I wouldn't recommend it. It's possible that your account can get banned for boosting. Um, but honestly, co-op is not a source of boosting. It's a thing that you guys can do in the game. It's literally in the game. I think that's the only reason people like co-op is just to grind XP in here, or just get kills or anything like that. That's why I have so much. Um, if you go to my um. Munitions. I have over 265,000 points. Uh, I don't think any a normal person should have that. For but I've been grinding so much to the point where I just get points from here. But reason being is in co-op. Um, I have a video on how to set this up and how to do it. It'll be in the link in the description, um, top of the description. You guys can always check out that video on how to set this up. Uh, I've had this had it out for on this channel for like a while now. But basically, all you guys gotta do is you guys just kill waves of enemies, and you guys just keep going until you guys max out in XP, and you guys can get up to like 200k XP. And to hit the 200k XP mark, you guys gotta be running a gun that has a perk with more money, which I would highly recommend, like an LMG. Make sure you guys have hardline equipped. Hardline gives you more boxes, more ammo, armor, grenades. So you guys just infinitely keep getting ammo armor grenades you guys don't have to worry about you know dying and um one quick fix because every person you kill gives you health back so you guys don't die and um another thing is make sure you have double xp going active maybe a token obviously by the time you watch this event is gone um so run a token like for me for example i still have all my weapon xp tokens i didn't even bother using them and i still have all these hour xp tokens for next season if i want to use them um, so I would honestly rec equip that and equip a uh, make sure regiment XP is going on make sure you get the most amount of kills and make sure you get a lot of headshots and you can possibly beat me when it comes down to the most amount of XP which I've gotten is like 209k in, in a match and put that in circumstances that's like the, if I'm like at 153 uh, I would honestly reach 155 in one game just the amount of XP I just got in that one match is insane and 
I believe co-op is like the best way and the best mission I would recommend this for is Strongbox because Strongbox you can easily just keep on going and also if you guys pay attention I always usually do weekly uploads on Tuesday about co-op but I've already finished these missions before so I kind of just didn't want to make a video about these but um if you guys want me to make a video about it again, I can definitely do that about the new modifiers and stuff like that. But um, by the time you guys are watching this, um, when I release this, it should be on a Tuesday. Uh, place where we're going to refresh. So that includes uh, co op. So hopefully we get new ones. I'm hoping for some season 5 stuff, season 5 weapon, or anything like that. I will definitely cover a video on it, a new variant. But um, yeah, that's going to be it for the video, guys. But that's how I reached 155. It's not, I didn't do some boosting, I didn't do any glitches, those exploits I was talking about, like you guys can do into trials. Um, I didn't like cheat, I didn't boost with the buddy or anything like that i did it the legit way and just playing co-op and just co-op just gives so much xp yeah, and that's how i level up all my guns too that's literally how i got damascus in like three weeks i have that video on my channel somewhere definitely go check that out uh that's all you guys gotta do just pretty straightforward just play co-op and if you guys want to play co-op play warzone don't want to play warzone or do plunder play tdm it, there's no special secret it's just that i grinded a lot for three days and i just didn't get sleep um but that's that's just how it is i'm just a youtuber that's just trying to get myself out there um just did the challenge as quickly as possible try to beat everyone that, you know uh, that was around me all the other content creators and just made it into a race for myself but um yeah just pretty straightforward i just played co-op but that's gonna be it for the video guys hope you guys enjoyed and stay tuned till the end if you guys did stay tuned to the end you guys are real uh real supporters and everything like that because i did support my channel a lot with uh time watched and everything like that it helps me grow but um yeah i'll talk to you guys in my next video. Peace out, guys.